Welcome to Tutorio. Did you know that around 2,500 metric tons of gold are mined each year? That's enough to fill three Olympic-sized swimming pools? Quite a thought, isn't it? Yet, have you ever wondered how this precious metal goes from being a raw material buried deep within the earth to a beautifully crafted piece of jewelry? Today, we're going to embark on that fascinating journey. First, miners have to locate potential gold deposits. They use a variety of methods, from old-school prospecting to advanced geophysical techniques. Once they find a promising site, the excavation begins. Using heavy machinery, they dig deep into the earth to reach the gold-bearing rock. This stage, known as the extraction phase, is labor-intensive and fraught with risks. Next comes the ore processing. This involves crushing the mined rock into smaller pieces and then using chemicals to separate the gold from the other minerals. The result is a semi-pure gold called a door. This might not look like the shiny gold we're familiar with, but it's a crucial step towards that end product. The door bars are then sent to a refinery. Here, they undergo a process called electrolysis to remove any remaining impurities. The end product is pure 24 karat gold, ready to be transformed into whatever form desired, be it coins, bars, or jewelry. Now you might be thinking, that's all well and good, but what's the catch? Well, gold mining and processing do have significant impacts on both the economy and the environment. On the economic side, gold mining creates jobs and contributes to local economies. It can be a significant source of foreign exchange for countries rich in this resource. However, it's also a volatile industry, sensitive to market changes and often reliant on the global economic climate. On the environmental front, the picture is less rosy. Gold mining can lead to deforestation, loss of biodiversity, and pollution of water sources with toxic chemicals used in processing. It's a heavy toll for a shiny metal. Yet, the story of gold doesn't end here. Many in the industry are seeking more sustainable practices, from better waste management to more responsible mining methods. It's a challenging journey, but one that's essential if we're to balance our desire for this precious metal with our need to protect the planet. So, the next time you admire a gold ring or a gold coin, remember the journey it has taken. From a potential gold deposit deep underground through the hands of miners and refiners to finally landing in your possession. It's a journey that's as fascinating as it is complex. A journey that's been part of human history for thousands of years and a journey that continues to shape our world in ways both seen and unseen.